Ah, it's a pleasure to see you. The annual Harvest Festival is coming up very soon, which we've all been looking forward to for many months now. Contrary to popular belief, we witches absolutely love helping others, and you're no exception. The Stew Cook-Off is one of the main events. I anticipate everyone is going to go all out, and they may just need your help finding the perfect ingredients for their stews. I know you've been waiting on this for a while. So here's your brand new training broom. This baby will take you wherever you want to go. There is a catch, though. It runs off magic dust, and it'll likely only get you from one region to the next. Help out whomever is in that region. And they might just reward you with some magic dust to get you to the next place. Ah, oh, that should do it. Make your old mentor proud. friend I have no idea how a place can be so darn cold my name is Linguini I'm a traveling chef and food blogger and when I heard about the stew cook-off here I had to come I just wish there were warmer accommodations everything else was booked anyway it's nice to meet you my stew well kind of stew I'm trying something new and making a frozen stew like Stewsicles. Perfect name! Thing is, I just need the last ingredient. Frozen moss. The interesting thing about frozen moss is the fact that it grows within ice. You'll have to find an iceberg or something and melt it to get any. Thank you!
This stew is gonna be so worth writing about, and it's all because of you. Thanks for the help. I've gathered some magic dust in my travels, and I really want you to have it. Thanks! Welcome to my place. I'm glad you made it. I'm Shelbert, and I've been collecting airplane stuff for as long as I can remember. Feel free to take a look around. Some of this stuff is a couple of hundred years old. I could talk your ear off about it for hours, but then I wouldn't be able to ask you for help. That's what you're here for, I'd imagine, right? I'm trying to make a stew that will soar over the competition, but it's hard to meet the sky-high expectations of the judges. I ordered a shipment of spider's herb. Just a sprinkle of it should take my dish to new heights. But the delivery balloon got struck by the lightning as it was flying over here. I was worried my stew would never really take off. But I'm sure you'll be able to get the spider's herb and shave my stew. You'll be looking for a downed balloon, and you'll find the ingredient inside the basket. I do it myself, but despite my love for all things flying, I'm rather scared of it myself. Thanks for the help. With this, my stew should fly right over the competition. It's all thanks to you. I got a shipment of magic dust the other day, and you can take some if you'd like. What are you up to? Oh, sorry, sorry. I need to speak more slowly. <laughs> I just get so excited when people come around, you know? Welcome to my place! If you look around, you'll see all my fine collected items. So many things just speak to me, so I just have to have them. <laughs> anyway, I guess you're here to help me make the best stew this world has ever tasted, right? Awesome. So, there's this plant called the Tears of Lacewing. There was this old dragon who flew about and planted it because he loved the flavor so much he wanted to share it with the world. It's so unbelievably spicy, but so unbelievably good. I have to have it. There's a cave nearby that should have it. Unfortunately, you'll have to fly to get there, and it doesn't look like you have wings like yours truly. Thankfully, here's the good part. There are geysers that you can hop into, and they should get you up to the top of the cave. Have fun, and thanks.
really hard to actually use this instead of just collecting it, but the world needs to taste this. Thank you so much for your help. I was gonna let you take a piece from my collection, but I wouldn't dare part with any of it. But I think I would be willing to let you take some magic dust I have. I hope that's enough to repay your kindness. Yo, dude, what's up? My name's Kappa Jerry, and uh, welcome to my shop. <laughs> you don't look like you're much of a surfer, though. Uh, right. You must be here to help out. You look just like that witch in town, you know? And that's a compliment. You're like a mini witch. All right, man. Well, I'm looking for the sickest ingredient I can think of. There's this creature called a mandrake fish, and it's got the smoothest flavor ever, man. This little fishy just goes with the flow. So you'll have to go find them in like tide pools or whatever. I can't remember which ones they like though. <laughs> Best of luck, mini witch. Right on, Mini Witch. This is sick. Should be everything I need to make my stew now. One of my customers paid me a magic dust a while back, uh, and I think you should have it.
Mm. Hi. Welcome to my fantastic place. It's just a little something something mommy and daddy put together for me. I'm usually addressed as your highness, but you can just call me Lady Urbos. I would only imagine you're here to do my bid uh, uh, to help me make the best stew the Harvest Festival has ever seen. What better thing to put in a stew than spop root? It'll give a rich and bold flavor that can't be beaten. You'll be able to find it in the mines nearby. Ta-da. Usually, I just give you a pat on the head for doing what you were supposed to, but this isn't my court, now is it? I figured you'd want something in return for your help, so here, take some magic dust. I know it can be useful for someone in a trade such as yours.
Ah, man. The mushrooms here are killer on my allergies. But the place was too good to pass up. I'm Finley. It's nice to meet you. I'm looking to make a spectacular stew, just like most other people, I'd bet. I got a special trick up my sleeve, though. A little thing called graveyard thyme. It's tangy and sweet and should blend well with my mushroom stew. There was a factory that used the stuff as a fuel, but it's been so long since I've been there, I can't remember the way. There are mushrooms about that should lead you to it. The factory sucks up spores, so if you hit the mushrooms, the spores should lead you there. Good luck. All right, thank you kindly. This really should make my stew something to contend with. I found some magic dust I had laying around. I can't quite recall where from. I bet a witch will be able to do something with it. Ah, uh, why hello there, young one. My name is Bartholomew, scholar by pleasure, a librarian by trade. Please make yourself at home in my little humble abode. You must be here to help me out, I presume. I truly appreciate your assistance. I'm looking for an ingredient by the name of Pigwort. I've read that it has an incredibly savory flavor with hints of sweetness. I believe it'd be the perfect ingredient to add, don't you? It grows high up in trees. I recommend looking there.
I have some use for this magic dust, yes? I can tell by all the happy faces around that you've done a rather marvelous job helping everyone out. You've made your old mentor very proud. And I know you're going to do a fine job helping people for many, many years to come. And what mentor would I be if I didn't give you the best going away present that I could think of? Here you are, the Cloud Rider 700. If you thought that last broom was good, just you wait! This one doesn't need any magic dust whatsoever. It gathers magical energy from the air. All you need to do is hop on and go. Well, that's about all from me. Go have a wonderful time. Ah, oh, what a lovely little festival. And everyone's stews are rather nice. Thank you once again for the help. If it wasn't for you, I don't think any of this would have happened. Pat yourself on the back, Mini Witch. Yes. People are absolutely delighted by my stew. As they should be. I've already written up a fantastic little piece on this festival. You'll have to read it when I publish it. This whole thing happened because of your help. 